are 10 not so cuddly cuties that I visit on the regular. First up, the long nose gar. Its mouthful of sharp needle-like teeth are housed in a very long narrow snout that can be used like chopsticks. It's covered in an armor of diamond-shaped, non-overlapping scales. From long snout to long neck, the eastern long neck turtle male bobs its head to track females. Another fun fact, they're sometimes referred to as stinkers because of the pungent odor they release when they're feeling stressed. Suriname toads' rough, oddly shaped bodies, small eyes, and large tongueless mouths come together to create an unusual looking aquatic frog. And if you look really closely, you can see the delicate star tip forelimbs it uses to shovel food into its mouth. And then there's the Argentine black and white tegu. It uses its tongue to sniff out prey and an organ in its mouth to process that scent information. Oh, and as precious as those cheeks are, don't pinch them. Big jowls indicate a strong-jawed, virile male. With lips like Jagger, who could resist Toby? A giant garami who steals guests' hearts daily. Seriously, there are so many photos of people pretending to kiss this guy. A giant garami has a special labyrinth organ that lets it get oxygen both via its gills and by gulping air. Here's one you might not have seen coming, the ripsaw catfish. Tiny eyes, bulky body, meaty burbles, and sharp scales. For me, the ripsaw catfish has this actor and Quaker Oats pitchman Wilford Brimley meets Toothless from How to Train Your Dragon vibe. If that yellowish brown and black striped speckled starry pattern doesn't do it for you, the snowflake eel's constant opening and closing of its mouth, something it needs to do to push oxygen-rich water over its gills, lets you imagine that you're engaging in some witty repartee. A prehistoric looking seafloor relative of the spider with lots of eyes and legs is cute, you say? <laughs> yeah, I mean, watching a horseshoe crab walk clumsily over its neighbor or ride itself with a rocking motion and the aid of its telson, a tail spike, is pretty delightful. Admittedly, this might have been a bit of a cheat, because who wouldn't find the striped burfish adorable? The way it can take in water or air to balloon up like a ball when threatened is amazing and I could get lost in those bulging eyes with iridescent blue-green specks. The horns protruding over its eyes, its little puckered mouth and box-like body shape just won me over. But this silly-looking scrawled cowfish is a fast mover, so it was hard to capture it on camera. This goateed beauty has the sensory barbels of a grizzled roadie and the musical chops to match. The black drum can make croaking or drumming sounds by vibrating its own swim bladder. Nature, it's a curious thing.